Hey guys, are you tired of seeing error message 277 on Roblox? Or perhaps you keep getting disconnected? Or your client keeps crashing? Well, fear not. Today, I've got your back. In this video. So, let's dive right in. First things first, let's tackle the network aspect of this problem. We'll start by changing the DNS servers on your computer. Follow along with me. Press the Windows key to open the Start menu. Then type Control Panel in the search box. Click on Control Panel to open it. Next, navigate to Network and Internet. Then click on Network and Sharing. Then on the left-hand side, click on Change Adapter Settings. Right-click on your network connection. A drop-down menu will appear. From there, click on Properties. In the Properties menu, Check Internet Protocol version 4, and then click on Properties. Now, select Use the following DNS server addresses and enter 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 for the first DNS server. And 8.8.4.4 .4 for the second one. Click OK to save your changes. Once done, Relaunch the Roblox app to see if the issue persists. If you're still facing issues, it's time to check your internet speed. Open your favorite web browser. And then click on search bar. Then search for speedtest.net. Run the speed test and ensure that your download speed is above 4 megabits per second as Roblox requires a minimum of 4 megabits per second for effective gameplay. If your speed meets the requirements, we can move on to the next step. Now, let's perform a complete clean installation of Roblox. Go back to the Start menu, Search for Add or Remove Programs and select Add or Remove Programs. In the search box, type Roblox and then uninstall the Roblox player. Once uninstalled, open your favorite web browser. Then click on the search bar. Then search for Roblox Download. Then open the Roblox official website. Then click on download. Its setup will start downloading. Once it is installed, click on it to open it. Then download the app. Finally, if you're still experiencing issues, it's wise to check the status of Roblox servers. Open your web browser and go to status.roblox.com. Ensure that you see a message stating everything operational. If there's an error message, it means the servers might be experiencing problems, and all you can do is wait for Roblox to fix it. And there you have it. I hope this step-by-step -step guide helped you resolve the Roblox error 277. If it did, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more helpful tips. Until next time, happy gaming.